Hi, I am doing a review on the March Tees by Sipsies.com. I am kind of tossed up by it. Um, there's two tees that I don't like. Um, there's two of them that I'm good with. So what I decided to do is I'm going to take a break from Sipsy and I cancel my subscription. I can always re-sign up. I want to try a couple other companies because this was a half and half roll for me. Um, I did try them with, I made my cups and I split them for my first cups. Um, I split them between, I poured them into three different cups after I made it and had it, you know, seep and all that and marinate. And then I poured it into three cups. Um, I had one that was regular, one with sugar, one with honey. Honey was a no-go in all, for, or all four of these teas. Um, the ones that were good were with sugar. There's two teas I absolutely hated, and there's only four teas in the pack. And one tea I'm like cool with, it's light, it's simple, and then there's one tea that I loved. Um, so that is my review on that so far. The lemon ginger, so I'm looking at my notes. Um, the lemon ginger, my review was... I, if I would drink it, I feel like I'd drink it when I'm not feeling that great. Because, you know, the lemon and ginger is very, very, very strong. Um, I can't see me drinking it with, out not feeling good. Because it reminds me of a sick, like, feeling sick tea. I don't see myself drinking it otherwise. Um, I am not a coconut person. I'm okay with the smell, but I cannot stand the taste. The dark coconut sipsy, sipsy um, I hated it. I hated it. Like, I tried to drink it. I couldn't even finish the cups. Like I said, I made one cup, which was one teaspoon for eight ounce of water. I made one of the eight ounces, and I split between three different ways, you know, to try a different version. I hated it. Um, I did pass it to someone else, um, see if they'll like it, it's just not my taste, and we do do a re um, they do ask you, like, what you like, what you don't like, um, what you would be interested in trying, what not, and I know I mark coconut is a no-no. Um, because I did mention a couple flavors, and you were, it was a yes or no, um, that was a big no for me, and I did get it, and I tried it, you know, tried to put my opinion aside, maybe I thought it might be good, <laughs> I did not like it at all. Um, the one I love the most was Little Bird by Sipsy. It's a dried tea. Um, the ingredients, and it was green tea, jasmine petals, heather, rose petals, papaya pieces, strawberry pieces, and natural flavors. I loved it. And it's very fresh. It's simple, but flavorful. You can taste the flavors, um, without overpowering each other. Um. I can see me buying a big bag of this, um, the Little Bird, um, Sipsy Dried Tea. I really did like that. Um, another one I liked was the Sweet Organic Yerba Mate Blend. Um, the Sipsy's Soulmate Yerba Company. That one there is a light tea, um, simple. Um, they marked it as high caffeine. I don't see it being high caffeine because so light it was. And the same one with the Little Bird. Little Bird was marked as low caffeine. I can see that. Um, the Dark Coconut, I can see that being high caffeine because it was very strong in flavor. But I, I really couldn't finish that one. Um, and then the Lemon Ginger, <laughs> I only took a couple sips of it. And I, it was just with honey, without honey, with sugar, regular. It is strong. You could swear you just, you know, grated up some ginger and squeezed some lemon juice. And a cup and called it good. It was that strong. Like, this is my opinion on this review of the March um, teas for Sipsy that I got. And you, if you guys look at my um, previous videos, you'll see what, which ones they were. Um, I did cancel the subscription. I want to try a couple of other companies. And I can always come back. Uh, two out of four on likes and dislikes seemed like a big thing for me. And... They were kind. They refunded. I did had a. I think I signed up for the three months prescription or subscription. Um, they refunded it. Um, the months I'm not going to use. I just two out of four felt like a lot that I didn't like, especially when it comes to tea. Um, 
Again, I might come back to the company. I really did not like two of them. Two of them. One of them I loved. One of them, you know, that could be an everyday simple tea. But the one I loved, I mean, like, I could drink it all day. And then there's the two that I absolutely hated. Like, a couple sips and I was good. Like, it reminded me of that citrusy, salsery, um thing you put in your water. Um, citrus C or energy C or something like that. Because of how strong those drink that is, it reminded me of that, and I'm like, I can't like drink this. I don't. I'm not sure if anyone else would like it. Um, I do have a sweeter palate for things, so I really thought that, you know, thought to be on a sweeter side. It is really strong. The ginger is very overpowering on that. Um, the Tulsi lemon ginger. And again, you if you look at my other video, you can see it. This is my review on this. I I can't say as much as I absolutely loved Little Bird. And the sweet organic Zerba Mate blend. Sorry, if I'm looking down, I'm looking at my card because I have my notes on the back of this card next to each of the, the teas. Um here. <laughs> I hope so I'm not looking I'm like fully looking down. Um I really, really, really liked Little Bird. And I'm cool with the mate blend. I <laughs> I hated the dark coconut and hated the lemon ginger. Like, the lemon ginger, I can see me drinking if I'm sick and I just want to get better. It really reminds me of, like, what my parent or, like, parents or, like, older folks would do with lemon ginger or, like, home remedies. It reminds me of that. Um, If I do come back to this company, I really hope it has better teas because I did not like this at all. Um, but I did say I was going to give you a review, and I was going to say it with the next box, but because I, I felt like two against two was kind of a toss-up, and I didn't want to try another month of two against two and waste tea, because, you know, someone else might like it better. But I was, th I am thinking about, um, trying a different company, and maybe just a review against the two companies, or just make a review in general, um, but this is my intake on that. Oh, I feel so disappointed, because I saw so many great reviews on it. Um, but then everyone has their own palettes and takes. I know that it's a toss up, and you know they're winging it with what you might like and whatnot. Just this is my opinion. I'm sorry if I made someone upset or whatnot. Please subscribe. These are opinions are fully mine. Um, everything I have, every a box I have now, I have purchased. I have found codes for, like I purchased this one, and I, I think I might have used a code that was on the website. All the codes are that I do use are from the website. I have not gotten any promos from anyone else, unless I've told you otherwise. Um, please subscribe. I am giving my honest opinion. Um, but everyone's opinions are different. Everyone's taste buds are different. So that's one hard thing about food or drinks is because everyone is different. They're not guaranteed to be the same review. Um, the most you could do is give your own opinion and put it out there. Some people might be similar. Some people might not. That is my opinion. I was kind of looking forward to four teas I would love. And I am very sad that I hated two of them. Um, but there was one that I did love. The other one's like, eh, okay, I can drink this. I'm not going to let it go to waste. Um. Again, I absolutely love the Little Bird. I was good with the sweet organic Yerba Mate blend. I hated the dark coconut. I mean, with a passion. I hated it with a passion. And pretty much the same with the lemon ginger. It was hard to drink. It was definitely not me. And we do do a review. We do a review on our personality, our food likes, our dislikes, our allergies. They do do a review. So I thought they would nail it. but And they didn't. So I'm hoping maybe I can try another one in the Desert Review. And you guys like it as well. Um, this was the March Tea by Um, You guys may in the future see another box. You may not. Um, I don't really don't want to keep subscriptions I don't like. But um, I am willing to take requests. And I have no problem trying something and showing you guys and giving my opinion. 
And hey, maybe you guys have a different opinion, or maybe you liked what it um what I had to offer. And so yeah, please subscribe. Please make a food emoji in this video. Um, leave comments, leave suggestions of what subscriptions you guys might want to see or what you like. I am willing to take the, the advice. My channel has only been open for a month, and um, I'm down for anyone's opinion on subscriptions um companies and uh, dislikes likes would like to seize and um yeah please hit the subscribe button um if you want to see notifications of when videos are loaded the bell um please put a food emoji to let me know you finished this video and overall please be healthy safe um i am sticking to teas because teas in the old days and herbs in the old days were medicine. And obviously I'm not, you know, against Western medicine. Um, I, you know, get my immunizations. I do what I gotta do. Do what the doctors say. But um, I am for herbs as well. Like, herb teas, you know, essential oils. I use them. They're great for diffusers um, versus having all those chemical sprays. Um, overall... Anything that's healthy and natural, like I try to get organic foods, I try to eat and drink and live healthy, obviously, <laughs> I can guarantee there's foods that aren't healthy, like mac and cheese isn't the healthiest, but it tastes amazing. This is just examples. Um, I'm not no fully organic eating person. I do <laughs> like to bulge on chocolate. Um, I do like to um try other things but overall i try my best to eat healthy but i'm human and my human opinion is i didn't like the on um, the two of two out of four and that was a big thing for me so i did cancel my subscription i can always re um subscribe i am going to try new ones because you never know there might be one i absolutely love and you guys might even like it so please um give me a shout out food emoji Subscribe, please. Um, I my channel's only been open for a month. I am trying my best. Advice. Um, I'm willing to, to answer to it. Um, yeah. Thank you. Be safe. And enjoy your week. And wherever you are, hoping the weather is perks up right now. Yes, it's all like snowy and wet. And after a week of having nice, awesome weather, where I'm at. So I'm hoping we perk up. The weather gets nice again, and I'm hoping the world perks up as well and things get better because right now it is not fun <laughs> um enjoy your day and overall be happy safe healthy and yeah